First alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Brianna Bermansolo. Tracking a cool down for the week ahead and the finish to the work week may be bring some of the coldest temperatures we've felt of the season so far and over the past several months. Looking back to our warm summer, we're feeling like fall. So it is mild today. That's a big part of today's forecast is one more day with temperatures in the 70s before we see a big dip to the 60s and then eventually the 50s soon. Big midweek cool down starts tomorrow. We'll see a partly sunny afternoon today. And again, 70s today quickly turn to the 60s by tomorrow. We'll be looking at temperatures making a 10 to 11 degree drop between today, 74 your high, expected high of 63 on Thursday. Overnight lows getting chilly as well. We might start to see some frost uh, soon, especially Wednesday night into Thursday morning, getting very chilly overnight. 68 on Sunday before another big system brings even cooler weather, upper 50s next Monday, well below average uh, for our temperatures this time of year. Satellite and radar, any rain you see falling is falling west of the Cascades, having a hard time getting over those eastern, uh, or excuse me, those western slopes. But we are seeing a few showers right now through the Kittitas Valleys. Uh, and as you look ahead to the evening hours, 2 o'clock, three, four, and through the evening commute, you can see much of that rain stays confined to the west side of the uh, Washington, Oregon area. On the east side, back here at home, you'll notice we do start to see a few showers possible by early Wednesday morning, moving through quickly, impacting mostly the southeastern corner of Washington, and then a couple of snow showers over our mountain passes for early Thursday morning. Otherwise, that's an end to our precipitation chances. Now, what we do see and what we do feel are the winds picking up today and after today, a big cool down. 68, the warmest day of the seven day forecast in Yakima today. 74, your high in Tri-Cities. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds today. Walla Walla, 75 and 72. Pendleton. So that was a lot to take in on the future cast as you saw a couple of systems impacting our week and even uh, the seven to 10 day outlook is showing above normal precipitation to the west. Love that for the mountains and our fire season as it does continue through the fall season. 63 cooler on Thursday. You may see a couple of showers in the Tri-Cities overnight. Much colder overnight. Look at those overnight lows in the 30s. Yakima, you could hit freezing tomorrow night through early Thursday morning, so you might start to see some frost out on the lawns and windshields. 61, your high on Friday. We'll see 60s for the weekend ahead and a chance of showers 